It's a vibe. A little B and B. On vacation and shit. Second day in Miami before we catch the cruise. But you know, on the way to the gym with the gang. So we're gonna see how this workout goes, you feel me? <laughs> we're gonna see how this workout goes. Let's see if I can catch a palm tree in this bit. Oh, you see that shit? Palm tree gang. Nice as shit. What are we gonna work on? We're gonna do full body or this chest triceps. You're the trainer. Alright, we can see. I think if we just do like three nice full body workouts, I mean every day we, we should be good. I'm benching today though, so I don't know if you're trying to bench or not. You said am I trying to bench? Yeah. I mean I'm here, so why not? I feel you. I just got show y'all the vibes we in little havana i'm dropping this video i'm not going to be here so if y'all try catching the galakin you know i mean there's no pop smoke situations here doing shit the club way it's a it's a it's a youtube channel it's not a gang you feel me free YSL. only thing you can get that reference huh You don't get that reference, do you? Uh, no, nah. no, no, I'm not. This I'm not nigga, this in. nigga, this nigga gonna snitch. <laughs> not snitch. He ca he called a plea deal, and the judge like had him go on the stand saying like, so. Look at this crib. Why so? Is it was like so? Why so? Is not the record la label. It is again. So I was just saying. The club it's a oh. youtube channel it's not the game no ricos you feel me no indictments <laughs> over here I mean, but yeah we in little havana walking to the planet fitness get yourselves a black card <laughs> i'm saying <laughs> go to any planet fitness on this globe for 20 dollars a month and some change you can't beat it or go to fucking your local one planet fitness for ten dollars a month Granny get me that. Damn, she's skinny. Mm -hmm. I'll see you, Granny. I mean, I might meet the love of my life on this trip, guys, so I'll keep you posted. I let Maria get away. That's what, <laughs> that's what I'm going to name her Maria. You know, I was, we was at this bougie ass. What is it? Spanish, you think? Yeah, restaurant? It was a Cuban restaurant. The Cuban? Okay, Cuban specifics. I got some Cuban chicken and waffles with some plantains. Damn, she's skinny. Mm -hmm. I'll see you, Granny. I might meet the love of my life on this trip, guys, so I'll keep you posted. I let Maria get away. That's what, <laughs> that's what I'm going to name her Maria. You know, I was, we was at this bougie-ass, what is it, Spanish, you think, restaurant? Yeah, it was a Cuban restaurant. The Cuban? Okay, Cuban specifics. I got some Cuban chicken and waffles with some plantains. I seen this little, little short joint looking to my soul. But we only in Miami for a day, so. Nah. What, technically like two. two days? Technically four. Two days and a half. Two days now, two days later. Yeah, but like a half. Like, I mean, like, would you count yesterday as a day? I guess. I mean, then today, then the little bit before you're on the boat. But all right, y'all. I'm going to tap in with y'all after the gym. We might hit South Beach or some shows, some tourists. Just got done, our workout was successful. Couldn't get a Smith machine because people just worried about getting fat asses. I mean, and I told you, you was like, just wait, just wait, just do something else. There's more. Some nigga that just walked in, just swooped up and took that shit. Like, I mean, but I, they got it, you from on vacation. I was kind of sorry they didn't have a, uh, a pull up bar. You know, I like to go out of town and do muscle ups and shit, you feel me? Go in there looking like a freak of nature and just walk out. I mean, got my Gatorade, electrolyte gang. But, uh, 
Yeah. We got, you said we got to get the rental? Yep. All right, yeah. But let this be a reminder to you guys. Put in the work. I mean, niggas in Miami right now. I should be I should be drinking some Henny. With my, my folks here, that's nigga driving me. Showing my black ass on South Beach. For me, but we made sure to get a workout. And look at the sky, though. Look at the sky, nigga. I know you don't want to be in the drone, but like, just look at it in the phone. Shit, nice, ain't it? Look, like, I feel like we out the country, you feel me? Like, <laughs> we ain't even get on the dock yet. But yeah, just tapping back into the vlog. I'll get with y'all niggas later. Yeah, Facts. We got the, we finally made some rest here. I got my tourist glasses on and shit. We got the Bugatti, you feel me? <laughs> 2021 Bugatti, you know what I mean? Flexing on the Miami hoes, you know what I'm saying? I'm, a, I'm passenger princess, cause you know real niggas got drivers. I mean, look, we got a sunroof. I woke up in a new Bugatti. I'm tall nigga. Smell like fucking. Yes. <laughs> smell like <laughs> black and mild <laughs> fucking low grade weed. Damn, baby. What we use, Toro to get this job? Yeah. You know, I'm a tall nigga, so I gotta adjust. I mean, we got the sunroof. Cocaine white, you hear me? Now the now the, the tour shit very, like begins now. So we just got back from uh, lunch. On a scale of one to 10, what you had? What you rating that at? Six. Six? Yeah, I mean, I got chicken and waffles again. You feel me? If, it don't, if it's not broke, don't fix it. I fucked with it. I'll put a picture, you know what I mean, on the video. I think we're going to South Beach. I don't know. <clears throat> I guess fucking so. But we're going to see how the vibes is. In the next clip, you might see me do a muscle up. I got to represent for Delaware. I seen this one nigga though. This nigga was waiting his whole entire life. To, I seen him do like, it looked like he did like 20. I don't know, at least 10. I was coming in like when he was getting tired. So I had to wait for him to retire for the day so I can come back and then, I mean, do what I had to do. But yeah, this shit nice, man. I see why niggas move here. Big tour shit. back from south beach and this this let me give you guys some tips man the south beach uh gyms that's on there the calisthenic joints and the gyms like that is not for the weak of heart you have to do some training before you go out there and embarrass embarrass yourself because we should we've seen the one boy with his girlfriend i seen this one nigga with his girlfriend he couldn't even do one pull up his girlfriend did the pull up and a half like that couldn't be me that that couldn't be my life. Then I see some all the girls out there are strong. I see one girl, what she do, like six pull-ups. Then some other girl that look kind of weak do like five pull-ups too. Now, I mean, I was up there doing muscle-ups, you know me. I mean, but I had I had the um imposter syndrome when we was walking past the first time because I seen this one nigga, like I said in the video before, that nigga was doing them. It was actually some YouTube niggas, some Goku Broly niggas, apparently. It was over there doing some crazy shit, man. Like, nah, I'm good on that. I need two more years of training. Like, but yeah, it was a vibe. I met, I met some, some cool people. I mean, I didn't talk to too many girls, but I did some networking. I, I met some niggas that ironically live kind of, you feel me, close to where I live in real life. So 
Yeah, I'm not hungry. We're going to figure out what we're going to get for dinner later on. What time is it? It's not even 7 o'clock yet. So we're going to see. But I'm just updating y'all. Day one and all well, day. One and a half, you know me, in Miami. If we get specific. But you see that glow behind me. You know what I mean, niggas is, niggas is glowing, living, living, living good. Energy on point. Eating broccoli and shit. You know what I mean? Healthy living. Eating broccoli. Yeah, eating broccoli and shit. Lettuce. Plant based. But yeah, we gonna I'll tap in tap back in with y'all niggas. So boom, you know what I mean? Got some pad Thai food with the gang. We about to see how this shit is. So we made it back from South Beach. I mean we gotta get the fuck up out of here at what eleven? Yeah. Yeah, then we gonna cruise the boat. We about to eat this food. Got some pad thai. I'll show you guys that in the next clip. Um, We about to just chill and take it down. The good thing about traveling with someone that you get along with is you don't got to do extra shit. And you don't have to worry about extra shit. We both simple people. We don't got to flex and trick on no Miami sugar babies. I mean, this is a sugar baby capital of the world. <clears throat> I believe so. And we don't got to get Yurises and Rolls Royces and shit. We literally just went down to South Beach, did some tourist shit, did some muscle ups. I met a few cool people, you know what I mean? Did some networking and we just took it the fuck down. I mean, the, the crews on the other hand, I'm going to be showing my black ass. I think so. And hopefully we both going to be showing our black asses and this is going to be a good time and a good vibe. I'll try to document that as much as possible for y'all. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going.